Hello everybody, it's Michelle Patterson here with Angel Souls and this is our daily card reading for May 4th, 2021. So let's see what we have going on for today. There's one sticking right out. Orange. So this is solar plex or solar plexus. <laughs> I know, sorry. This is the sacral chakra, creativity, um, your manifestation powers. Yes. So the seed of sexuality, all of that. So this is orange. Nurture yourself. The number is 16 reduces to seven. So there is a healing that needs to be done around the sacral chakra. This can also be money flow as well. Not many people know that. We associate that with the root chakra as well. But this is your emotional body, which is, you know, doubling up with the heart space. You know, don't neglect that area, right? So make sure you are opening up uh, anything, your creativity to help you heal. That's the message for today. What creative act can you engage in to heal any kind of emotional trauma or again, get proper support as well to help with the psychological self uh, or say it again, unlock, unlock a realization. All right. So that, all right. So some of us are hiding and they're saying trauma. And this is like childhood trauma. So some of us are hiding that. We're seeing it as normal or seeing it as not a big deal. Remember what I was saying about how we get controlled? We get controlled in our thinking. And um, there is this thing where it's like social pressure to think a certain way or to do certain actions and what have you. Um, there's a lot of social pressure here to just let it go. Stop talking about it. Don't, don't go there. Why are you bringing that up? Oh my God, you're still on that? Okay, so we need to stop being silenced, I think is essentially what they're getting at here. And we need to start speaking up for ourselves. We need to start speaking out. This isn't so that we come from a victimhood mentality, but rather having that awareness for ourselves. Where is there still pain stuck? And yes, it could be manifesting in a physical way. We know that that can happen. But where, where have we taken a pain that's maybe so big and, and try to put, put it in a hiding place. It still hurts us, but if we can't see it, we think like, no, it's just, it's that pain's due to something else. And if I put my energy away from me, outside of me, I don't have to face that. And then I can throw all my energy into a career or be obsessed with what someone else is doing, be obsessed with how they think of me or feel about me. I can distract myself from that pain by getting involved in drama. Let me come over here and start a little drama. Let me twist someone's words so we can have a debate. Let's argue over things that don't matter. Let's go off and try to control other people and tell them how to live. So long as I don't have to be in the same house as this thing. That's what we're doing. And let this be a day where you go within, you keep your energy to yourself. And anybody else out there who's trying to do their little distraction tactic and drag you into it, you can say, no, no, I'm going to be at home. No, I'm going to take care of myself and meditate. Again, I have put out this Archangel Michael seven day meditation challenge. I will have the meditation up on my YouTube channel. Work with Archangel Michael. Tune in. This is also Archangel Gabriel energy. I will be coming out with that series uh, here shortly, but Work on that and see if little by little with the proper support, I cannot stress that enough. Make sure you have proper support. Your friends are not your support. My friends are, stop it. Your friends are not psychologists. And there can be bad psychologists out there as well. So you have to be very discerning about what the right kind of care is for you as you look at and reveal some of these deeper truths is what they're saying about your human story. And what have you learned from that? What are you still carrying with you? We have to look at that. This is how we're going to be able to move on. And this is how we're going to have to raise our consciousness by not feeding this beast. All right. We're going to leave it there. I'm sending you all so much love and take care.